here we are. Start of another vlog. Vlog number two. See if this one gets better, any better than the last one. Uh, Saturday morning, 8.38. 30 minutes behind, no big deal. It was raining outside, so no, no big rush. Uh, loaded up, going to Rocky Hill, do some openers, do some pre-ride action. Cole's with, a, with me, he's riding the Pro Loop for the first time. Should be a good, should be a good day. Won't spend too long out there. Got to stop at the bike shop on the way, and uh, yeah, have some fun in between. Almost missed the old entrance to the old riggedy, rockety, rockety hill ranch. Go! We have made it to Rocky Hill. Looking, uh, looking all right. Ground looks. Not super soaked. Bikes that are riding don't look completely muddy. We thought we were going to be able to park way over there like we normally were, but immediately got kicked out because I think, I think, I think they're just, you know, the mafia name. They're just scared, but it's okay. It's okay, so we're smiling. We're happy. We'll take what we can get right here, right in the middle, right after the start, right in the feed, so that'll be cool. Now we get, uh, get the bikes out. Still wait for it to dry a little bit, and then uh, check out the pro course. See how slippery it is. Take you guys, uh, take you guys along. Not on the chest mount this time, because uh, chest mount kind of sucked last time. About to do a little pre-ride action, give you guys a little taste. This angle should be a little bit better than the chest mount, so uh Wee. Oh. Lots of front end in that sweeper. Dude, I hit it so fast. I had it all on GoPro.
Uh, Carson. Yes. How are we doing today, buddy? Pretty good, you know. are we? Where are we at? We are, uh... Did we forget already? Uh, at Warda. At Warda. <laughs> this kid's laughing a lot. The kid came out from Colorado. There's no mountains down here. He forgot that. Got some, got some little groms shredding. Gonna have a good day racing bikes tomorrow or what, Carson? We got the, this, 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 this chief captain right here. Lead the pain train at his backyard house. Should be, should be fun when it's done. All right, free reg, a registration, packet pickup, done. Don't have to do that tomorrow. That's always good. Lucky number six. Just don't know how lucky number six will be, but six, we're running with it. Temperature is dropping significantly out here. I feel like I'm in an Arctic blizzard. Merlona, hi, how are you guys? Luna, are you ready? Are you coming to the race today? Are we coming, what's the deal? We ready? Yep, going for the race. It's gonna be really warm. Make sure you get those coffee shots. Let's go. All right, we're on the way now. We are a little more packed than we were yesterday. We've got two doggies. Same amount of bicycles. And we had another human being. A race support, team crew, feed master, LK Norling. <laughs> it's still early. It's not really that early. It's 840. But about an hour and 25 minute trek. Already got the number on. We're already ready to go. Really, just need to get on that dang dong bicycle and get warm. Feeling like 23 degrees based on weatherchannel.com up in Smithville, so that should make things cold. Currently trying to figure out which layer I'm going to wear. Might be looking like an onion. Rocky Hill. It's cold. It's freezing. Everyone's bundled up. Still trying to figure out what layers to wear. Look at Ginger. Ginger's freezing. Bike looks good. Ready to send it. Ginger's still cold. Second guessing life. <laughs> Post, post race, once again we didn't get a pep talk before the race. Too cold, delayed start from 12 originally to 12.30 to 12.45 to finally we established 1 p.m. start time. So had a nice hour long warm up that never really got us warm. Uh, finally took off, lots of fast guys today. I got kind of scared because the legs never really opened up. They were numb for the whole first lap. Popped off the lead group, which sucked. And then come back around, was able to find some legs after the first lap, shed the jacket, caught Jorge, who was sixth. We rode together for a little bit, let him, let him pull me through some wind. Then I got through him, he fell off of me. And then like normal, Justin gets to ride around for the whole race by himself. Uh, ended up catching Canyon, which was cool. But ended up he ended up flatting, so that sucks for him. Uh, rode around in fifth the duration. Ended up actually ended up actually catching Braden Lang right at the end. I think he was in chill mode because he was also riding by himself. We typically end up together, whether it's in the beginning or at the end. Uh, all in all, good race. It, it started raining. It got really cold, really cold. Uh, I'm pretty much speechless, other than. Ginger, you been getting naked the whole time in this video back here? Uh, not naked. <laughs> I was just thinking. How how how'd you do, Ginger? I finished. You finished? Yeah. Good. <laughs> Didn't quit like Neil. Yeah. Did uh, where did you finish? Do you know? 
Nah, I'm not too sure. I kind of didn't do too good off the start. I was just blew up immediately. And Did you see me get boxed out on the start? Yeah, you yeah. went like, well, it was horrible. You need to take lessons from Ken Roxon. Dude, my start was terrible. I know, you were just, I said, look, he's in sixth place already. Dude. But you were in seventh place. Yeah, I said, oh yeah, I wasn't seventh. I said, shift, shift. Dude. What did you, like, you started in, like, for, you started in first gear, but gear entirely, like, look, he's, look, those guys are pulling away and, Dude, and then we had to, we got bottled, and then that was kind of sketchy. But then I used the grass and made my way around Nathan Winkleman, which was good. And then I made, I was at the back in seventh in the in the group, but my my legs and my lungs just were not awake at all. But regardless, they came back around. We recovered. We won a top five. We got top five. So next time we need to say we want top three, and hopefully we'll deliver a top three. But all in all, racing against a bunch of freaks, we'll keep building on it. Keep getting faster, keep getting stronger, and keep having more fun than anyone else, really. Until next time, hopefully it's warmer. Made it back home. Another weekend of racing. Another weekend traveling, trying to grow. Get the legs str oh, strong, I've got the hiccups now. Mm, good dose of the hiccups. Anyone else that raced today feels my lung pain in the cold air. It's just brutal, but happy to be home, happy to be healthy, happy to continue building on this journey. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully this vlog was better than the last one.